Well, Garth came from, to us from the Yukon. He's a... Uh, the Humane Society in Yukon had rescued him. I guess he was found running loose at large. He had a broken leg and was a bit underweight, quite a bit. They arranged a fundraiser for him and they actually raised enough money to get the surgery done for his hip. Garth arrived here on the 15th, which was a Saturday. He was using his leg maybe one time out of every eight steps. And by Monday, it looked like the leg had actually um, swollen up in the area where the surgery was, and he wasn't using it nearly as much. And there was quite a bit of heat just coming off of the wound in general. Tracy had taken a look at him, and uh, we called the veterinarian in Juneau and, and got him sent out on a flight uh, as soon as we could. The next day, the doctors from Southeast Alaska Animal Medical Center had basically undid the surgery that was already done to him and cleaned out all the infection inside of there and put it back together. When they closed him up, they sutured it together and put um, some drains in there so that the fluids that build up within the wound have a place to go out and they don't build up within his leg. Garth has a, a, quite a few meds that he's on now. He's taken the Cipro, Cephalexin, uh, Tremadol, and then, of course, Rimadol. So all four of those meds twice a day, 12 hours apart. It's Christmas Day. We're about to take Garth out for his walk, and um, you can see how he's progressing on that leg. Energetic. He's a love. He's a sweetheart. He'll curl up with you right away. He's playful. Um, he's a chewer. He's a husky. He's a, a Yukon sled dog. You know, we're really hoping to find him a, a permanent home. He, he deserves it.